China scientists may have just rewritten the future of batteries. A team has unveiled a hydride ion battery that works at room temperature and can store six times more energy than many lithium ion designs. It's real, rechargeable, and powerful enough to light a bulb, but its potential goes far beyond that. In this video, we'll explore how this technology works, why it's groundbreaking, and how it could transform clean energy forever. At the heart of this discovery lies a question that has puzzled scientists for decades. Can hydrogen, the universe's lightest element, replace lithium as the main charge carrier in rechargeable batteries? The answer, according to this new research, might finally be yes. Traditional lithium-ion batteries rely on positively charged lithium ions moving back and forth between electrodes through a liquid or gel electrolyte. But the Chinese team took a completely different approach. Instead of lithium, they used hydride ions, which are negatively charged hydrogen atoms, H. These ions can theoretically store far more energy per gram because they're lighter and carry an extra electron. The challenge has always been stability. Hydride ions tend to react too quickly or escape at normal conditions. The key innovation came from a core shell solid electrolyte made of a rare earth-based compound. Inside the material, the team used cerium trihydride, so H3, at the core, known for high ionic conductivity, and coated it with a thin shell of barium hydride, by H2, to maintain stability and prevent unwanted reactions. This pairing created a new environment where hydride ions could move freely at room temperature without breaking apart something previously considered nearly impossible. Using this electrolyte, they built a working solid-state battery. It used SuH2 as the negative electrode and Nile H4, sodium aluminum hydride, as the positive one. In lab tests, this setup delivered an impressive 984 million powers per gram in its first cycle, far surpassing standard lithium cells. Even after multiple charges, it retained a significant portion of its capacity. When several layers were stacked together, the battery reached a 1.9 volt output, enough to light a yellow LED, clear proof of concept that this system can power real devices. This success wasn't just about numbers. It demonstrated that hydrogen-based ions could finally be stabilized inside a rechargeable, safe, and efficient battery architecture, a milestone once thought out of reach. Why does this matter so much? Because it challenges the foundation of modern energy storage and could reshape industries built on lithium technology. The first major reason is capacity. Hydride ions are lighter and carry more charge per unit mass, meaning they can store more energy in a smaller, lighter cell. The team's measurements showed their design could reach up to six times the capacity of some lithium-ion batteries under similar testing conditions. That kind of leap could extend electric vehicle ranges dramatically or make renewable energy storage systems vastly more efficient. The second reason is safety. Unlike lithium batteries that rely on flammable liquid electrolytes, this system uses a solid-state structure, which drastically reduces the risks of overheating or combustion. It also avoids dendrite formation, the microscopic metal filaments that sometimes cause lithium batteries to short circuit. Because hydride ions are negatively charged and travel through a stable solid medium, these hazards are naturally minimized. Third is sustainability and material availability. Lithium mining has environmental and geopolitical challenges, as lithium resources are unevenly distributed across the planet. Hydrogen, however, is one of the most abundant elements in existence. Combining it with other widely available materials, such as sodium and aluminum, could reduce the global reliance on rare metals and make large-scale clean energy storage more sustainable. Yet, there are still limitations. The voltage of 1.9 V is lower than typical lithium-ion cells, which usually range between 3.2 V and 4.2 V. Additionally, the prototype's performance decreased from around 984 milliamp hours per G to about 402 milliamp hours per G after several cycles, showing that durability remains a major challenge. Even so, the principle has been proven hydrogen-based energy storage is now a working reality, not just a theory. This discovery marks a turning point, showing that it's possible to go beyond lithium and open a new chapter in energy innovation. So where does this lead? The implications of this technology go far beyond powering a single LED. If scientists can improve voltage, durability, and scalability, 
Hydride ion batteries could play a vital role in everything from electric transportation to space exploration and grid scale storage. Future versions could power electric vehicles capable of traveling several times farther than current models without increasing battery weight. For renewable energy systems, they could store daytime solar power for longer periods, providing steady, reliable electricity at night or during cloudy days. Their solid state design also makes them ideal for aerospace applications where safety and energy density are critical. From a research perspective, the next steps are clear. Scientists will need to optimize the electrode materials, strengthen the electrolyte's long-term stability, and increase operating voltages closer to lithium's performance range. That means finding new hydride combinations that can handle higher energy densities while maintaining safety and structural integrity. Large-scale testing and manufacturing trials will also be essential to determine cost feasibility and consistency under real-world conditions. Beyond engineering, this achievement sends a powerful message to the scientific community that genuine innovation sometimes requires venturing into uncharted territory. The success of this battery challenges the notion that lithium-based chemistry is the ultimate standard. It invites researchers to explore other ions, other materials, and even hybrid systems that merge the best of multiple approaches. If this technology continues to advance, it could redefine how we think about clean energy. Safer batteries, cheaper materials, and higher capacity, all driven by hydrogen simplicity. The hydride ion battery may still be in its early days, but it represents the kind of leap that reimagines what's possible for the future of power and sustainability on our planet. This isn't just another battery experiment. It's a glimpse into what might replace lithium altogether. The hydride ion battery combines extreme energy density, solid state safety, and abundant materials in one bold design. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and don't forget to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.